Will he stay or will he go? Ohio State says the Urban Meyer investigation will likely be wrapped up in about two weeks. Thanks for joining us at 5. I'm Mark Taylor. And I'm Katie Farrell. Until then, it's really business as usual for Buckeye football players who are actually checking into the team hotel for camp right now. Sports Director Jared Smalley is here now with more. Jared. Hey, good evening, Mark and Katie. The Ohio State's preseason will kick into high gear this week, and the team will be living together at a hotel over in Grandview when they're not on the practice field. Head coach Urban Meyer, of course, still on leave tonight, so the camp is being led by the acting head coach, Ryan Day. All of this ahead of the September 1st season opener against Oregon State. NBC4's Audrey Hassan joins us now live from Grandview, where the Buckeyes are moving into that hotel at this very moment. Good evening, Audrey. You know, Jared, Katie said it right. It is business as usual here, and it's kind of a red carpet arrival as players arrive here. That's Liam McCullough, of course, the long snapper. He's always a big fan favorite as he wears his T-shirt of him arriving at camp in front of all the media here. But this is all part of the team bonding as they now get to bunk with their roommates here at the hotel because, of course, they've had three days of practice for camp already. But we're going to take a look at players have been arriving. They have in between the four and six to arrive here. There's also BB Landers coming in here. But the first few campers to arrive stepped off of the campus bus because, of course, they're making their way from their campus housing to the hotel here in Grandview where they'll stay over the next few days of camp. Some of them getting dropped off by family or friends. Even their dogs are in the car as they make their way to the hotel and officially report for camp. But the camp roster consists of 110 players. We've been told no injuries in the first three days of practices, but they do have the day off um, today to in order to get their belongings, get it all together to arrive here at the hotel. But it is it's business as usual. They get back to practice tomorrow. They'll be in full pads for the first time at Wednesday's practice. And of course, we'll get a look at them also tomorrow as the season is now just less than four weeks away for the Buckeyes 2018 season. But let's head back to Jared's 